You could see a large part of the damage here is in the front part of the house. Now, all four people who were inside managed to get out okay, but that's because they exited through the back. As flames jetted through the roof, down below, crews worked to get a grip on the Tennessee Avenue blaze. We had a little problem with water supply in the beginning. We got that straightened out. The flames so intense, those nearby could feel the heat. It was very hot. Fire Chief Jeff Arnold says the fire moved from the porch to the structure itself, breaching the walls, then reaching the attic of the two-story duplex. We were just looking out the window, and um, it, was, it was scary. You can see there's not much left on the front porch, but this overturned grill, used frequently by one of the tenants, says Chip Huggins. He grills in the front yard. But Chief Arnold says the fire is under investigation, saying the origin and the cause are unknown at this time. Neighbors say two couples lived inside. It's terrible with the holiday. Thankfully, there were no reported injuries. Meanwhile, this happened. Yeah, our water's <laughs> off. Huggins says he woke up with no water, and Pittsburgh's Action News 4 has learned that 40 other customers were in the same boat. Pennsylvania American Water says there's a six inch main break nearby, but it could not say if this water main break is connected to the early morning fire. In Dorma, both to Imam, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.